So all this while, the reason why Fanny Face has been ranting on social media is because he wanted or wants his baby mama, Van, uh, Vanessa Nicole, back. Omo. This is why this guy has been ranting all over. We don't even know what this baby mama has shown to Fanny Face that he can't even let her go. It's been Fanny Face. Uh, so it's been Vanessa, 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 Vanessa. Vanessa is not allowing me to see the kids. Vanessa is refusing to pick my calls. Vanessa is tormenting me. Vanessa is doing this and that. All these were not knowing. Funny Face doesn't even he talks to the kids all right, unlike what he portrayed to social his social media fans. He speaks to his kids, talks to them whenever he has access to them whenever he needs. However, it's the fact that his baby mama, that is Vanessa Nicole, has not been minding him or has not been giving him that attention that is making him rant on social media. So just yesterday, Vanessa granted an interview. Now, it was this interview that he revealed certain things that the public didn't even know because at this point we were all listening to one side of the story that is funny face's story which is painting his baby mama black funny face ranted on social media telling the world how his baby mama has been stressing him preventing him from seeing the kids but then according to vanessa it's all a lie so granted the it have interview she spoke with one tiktoker identified as sunny yes the guy's name is sunny and according to vanessa Funny face, he doesn't she doesn't know why funny face has been ranting on social media, honestly, because he has access to the kids. Nothing is preventing him from I mean coming to Komati to see his kids. But then if he wants her, her, that is her Vanessa back, he needs to apologize to her family. Because a couple of years ago, when this ranting and everything started on social media, funny face allegedly dissed or insulted the family of Vanessa. So to her, in order not to show her disrespect to her family by, you know, going to Funny Face's place all the time or in the name of we have kids together, she wants Funny Face to come and then apologize to her family, you know, because he has access to the kids. He has the number of her nanny. You know, Vanessa has three kids, Ella and Bella and then Kimberly, that is the last one no she has a first one before the three kids with uh, funny face so in all she has four so she has a nanny who takes care of the kids and according to her funny face has the number of this nanny calls then uh, the nanny or can call the nanny anytime just to talk to the kids but anytime funny face calls all he says is i want to talk to ama that is um, vanessa nicole and according to her you and i don't have any relationship like the only relationship we have is co-parenting you are my baby daddy we only have co-parenting. We are not married or anything. No, you are just my baby daddy. So if you want, why do you want to talk to me? Talk to your kids. I don't have that kind of relationship with you. So that is the boundaries she has set with funny face. And it seems that is what is killing this guy. It seems because you have access to your baby. But then to gain sympathy from social media, he came out to say that, um, Vanessa Nicole has been preventing him from seeing the kids. But meanwhile, according to Vanessa, you talk to your kids. But even it's not frequently because anytime you call, you want to talk to her, Vanessa herself, but she's not interested. And then, you know, the host asked Vanessa, do you think a baby daddy uh, has some feelings for you? She was like, she doesn't know. And then the host was like, what if funny face wants to come back? And then she was like, if he wants to come back, she doesn't have a problem. Her only problem is come and apologize to my family for disrespecting me and them because there's no way she's going to pick up her bag and then you know go straight to funny face knowing very well that he has disrespected his uh, sorry her family so this is the whole issue about funny face ranting on social media about you know gaining sympathy and people are calling him a narcissist and all that i mean it's just been back and forth with these two people vanessa has so, as finally said her side of the story and in all that funny face is saying it's a lie he has access to the kids he has access to talking to the kids but then he's only pained because she vanessa is not coming back to him that is his only pain omo have you seen vanessa have you seen this lady with a big uh sorry to say i i know it's not right to describe a lady like that but this lady is a full package that is why funny face is just uh, running all over the place scattering everywhere and stuff because he can't afford to lose her she's a whole spec she's a whole package she has the body she has everything she's very very beautiful i'm not gonna lie vanessa is very very beautiful 
and if these things can be settled i think she should just funny face should just apologize to the family settle with his uh, baby mama for the sake of the kids because the way he's going about ranting and stuff i won't be surprised if he's being sent back to the psychiatric ward yes i won't be surprised because the way he's going about things is like the kids are all he has left but according to the baby mama you talk to the kids but it is me that you want that is why you've been ranting and he's trying to use the kids as a, a, a comeback to her but she's not allowing that because in the first place you need to apologize to my family before you even have access to me that is why he's He's pain. They should just put pride and ego aside and then just settle these things. Gaining um, 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 social media sympathy and stuff, um, it will hurt you. In the, it will come back to hurt you, the person. Believe me, it will come back to hurt Funny Face 10 times than what he's doing. Because now people, after listening to Vanessa's side of the story, people are going under his comment section, calling him out like, you know what, bro? This thing that you were doing, that you were supporting, the lady has finally spoken and it's not even what you made us believe just go to commerce apologize to your in-laws take your kids back take your baby mama back and this whole thing will be over